And now on Hometown Radio 1580 KGAF, it's time for Hometown Community Service. Here is Dee Blanton. Thanks very much. Hi again, everyone. Welcome to our Thursday Community Service Program. Today, Munster Memorial Hospital Day. And I am very uh, proud and happy to have a girl that I've known since uh, she was a baby, actually. Uh, and I'm talking about Karami Graves, Karami Clement Graves. And uh, yeah, when I first knew you, you your, your mom was holding you in, in her arms. Yeah. How you doing? I'm doing great. How are you? I'm doing well. It's good to see you. Karami has grown into a beautiful young woman with a very important position at Munster Memorial Hospital, and that is as the manager of the wellness center there. And uh, some of you may be thinking, I didn't know they had a wellness center at Munster Memorial, but Karami, this is nothing new. It's been around a while, hasn't it? It has. When we added on our beautiful new therapy and wellness center almost five years ago, we opened it up for the public. So we're open seven days a week for anyone to come in, work out. We guide them and help them make good, healthy decisions with their lifestyle. Explain to the folks what all is included. What, what's in there in the Wellness Center? Well, we have state-of-the-art cardiovascular and strength training equipment. When you sign up, I actually personally go through, teach you how to use the, all the machines, check your blood pressure, and help you work towards any goals you may have. We also started offering classes, and those have really taken off, so we're just really excited about everything we have going on. And uh, now, for those that may be confused, including me, uh, is this something that requires a doctor's prescription, or can anyone in in the community uh, partake in this? How does all that work? Anybody can come in and join the gym. You do not have to have a doctor's prescription to be a wellness center member. Mm -hmm. So only the patients have to have prescriptions. All right, very good. And uh, that makes it a little easier. And I'm sure the folks in Munster are very happy to have that facility there, right? Yes, they are. In the mornings, we have a wonderful group of our geriatric population that have coffee and work out every morning so i enjoy getting all the gossip every day yeah you know it's it's it, it probably i'm sure they feel like it beats going to just some coffee shop or restaurant and having a cup of coffee let's go up there and walk and exercise and uh, and absolutely visit. yeah it's, it's it's the place to be all right uh, we, we've kind of covered the basics for it uh, you mentioned that uh, the wellness center has started uh, some classes talk about what those are First thing we started offering, which I'm very excited about and I personally teach, is our water aerobics classes. And I teach them four days a week. I offer several times throughout the day. And water aerobics is a great form of exercise for anyone who has any joint pain, back pain, arthritis. It's a zero gravity environment. So any activity that you may have difficulty doing on land, you probably can do it with ease in the water. Mm -hmm. So... Another perk of it is you burn one and a half times the calories working in the water than on land. So you're actually getting a little bit more bang for your buck, too. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's that resistance that the water provides. That, mm-hmm. uh, but it's a gentle resistance. Yes. It, it's easy on your joints, right? It is. Um, the other class we offer is taught by Sally Haney, and she is a personal trainer, and she specializes in geriatrics. But it is Tai Chi. And it's great for stress relief. It's low impact. Um, it's slow, gentle movement. It really works on your balance. So uh, we've got a great response from it, too. So. Yeah, I, I, th- I think for years I thought Tai Chi was another form of, of karate or judo or something. But it's, it really is a, basically a, it's a balance type thing, right? It is. It started off with the martial arts, yeah. and it's kind of gravitated into the wellness portion, but yeah, and see, that's neat to me because you don't necessarily have to go tear somebody up to uh, take that's advantage right, of That's right, but you're G. learning some moves, so maybe it'll give you some benefit in the future if it ever came about. At the very least, it'll help you get away from the bad guy if that's it ever right. happens, right? Now, uh, another thing I know that you, you wanted to visit about was uh, was the hours that you're open because uh, as time has gone on, and, and now just recently you've expanded the hours just simply do to make it available to more people, I guess, right? We do. We open at 5 in the mornings during the week, so we close at 8 at night for a short period of time there just because it was getting really hectic. We closed where you could only use half of the gym throughout the day. So the gym is open all day long, every day, and then we're open half days on Saturdays and Sundays. Mm -hmm. And uh, I'm a little confused, too, because I know that you have folks that are 
uh, patients in the swing bed unit that require uh, physical therapy and the like, do they also use these facilities? They do. So you'll be right there in the monks of the patients. And it actually, Munster is such a small community. Everyone knows each other. And so many of the patients enjoy getting to see faces they haven't seen in a while. Right. So it really helps the morale of our patients, too. They look forward to coming down because they might have been a shut-in or not had as much community um, communication. So getting to see familiar faces to them just kind of puts a smile on their face. Too. Yeah, yeah. well, you can say not just Munster. You can say that about Cook County. We're all sure. one pretty close-knit group. And, mm -hmm. you know, it, it, this is one of those situations you hear about. Everybody knows everybody. Right. And uh, everybody's business, unfortunately, but uh, that just goes along with small communities, yeah. uh, for sure. But uh, talk a little bit about, uh, I, I guess, because you've had to expand hours and uh, and all, I, I guess this has been very popular among not only the residents, but uh, from what I hear, the patients that are actually there uh, really kind of enjoy it. They love the therapists they work with and, and just really get a lot out of it. Yes, we have an incredible staff in our wellness and therapy department. Um, we draw patients from Denton County, Southern Oklahoma, through Montague and Grayson County. So it's a wide range. Um, our patients just come from anywhere, and we get very few complaints, which is really <laughs> something to be said for because exactly. it's a variety of people. And, I, you know, I would imagine that probably the easiest way, if, if you're from Cook County, anywhere really in Cook County, and uh, you you find yourself in need of it, your doctor is going to prescribe physical therapy or even, you know, cardiac therapy after heart procedures or whatever, you know, you guys can handle all of that. And really all the patient needs to do is tell the doctor, hey, I really want to have that done at Munster, and they'll take care of it. That's right. They'll send me over your prescription, your insurance cards, and we'll be giving you a call and setting you up. Yeah, and, and, you know, the, you can make it easy. Just tell your doctor you want to do your rehab, whatever kind it is, at Munster Memorial Hospital. And uh, uh, me and all the folks over there, they're friendly, maybe the friendliest staff I've seen in any hospital I've ever been to. And, again, a lot of that can be attributed to small-town feel and small-town atmosphere. And uh, I, I think folks can't go wrong with that. Uh, again, give us the hours for, uh, for the Wellness Center and how someone who's interested can get involved. It opens at 5 a.m., closes at 8 p.m., Monday through Friday. We open at 7 a.m. and close at 1 on Saturdays and noon to 5 on Sundays. And all you have to do is walk in, and we'll have a couple papers you just have to sign, and you're ready to go. Man, that sounds great. Uh, and I hope even more continue to take advantage of this. And uh, if you've been on the fence, if you live if you live in Munster and you've been thinking about it but just weren't sure, uh, go ahead and give it a try, and I guarantee they'll make you feel welcome. You'll be glad you... Uh, Glad you did that. Karami, continued success, and I'm so happy you came in and did the radio show this morning. Thank you. I appreciate it very much. There she goes. She's Karami Graves, uh, the manager of the Wellness Center at Munster Memorial Hospital, and we appreciate her being on the show today. It's going to wrap it up for our Thursday program this week from MMH here on Hometown Radio 1580 KGAF. <laughs>